Imagine gas leaks, no running water, and no air conditioning in this heat. Was well, exactly the kind of issues that some tenants here at Hembola Manor Apartments say they have been dealing with for some time now. I'm Angie G. St. your North Lafayette Parish reporter, and now those tenants tell me they are tired of the back and forth and just want the issues to be resolved. The ceiling's caving in, they got molds in the apartment, they got trash on the property. I mean, it's not kept up. Complaints over the conditions at Hembola Manor Apartments. Um, the hallway roof had started leaking. And I went to her and I told her, but at the time we didn't have a maintenance man. So eventually one day I come out the bathroom and as I turn the corner, the roof just come down. So I stayed there for about a month like that because they was having trouble finding somewhere to put me. And where I'm at now, it's not really that much better. Not wanting to show their faces on camera for fear of eviction. Residents here saying they have nowhere else to go and have had to deal with the ongoing situation despite their concerns. One woman says her sister's unit has no running water. She can't take a bath nor use her own toilet. Basically, she has to go to our grandma house. And what do they say when you complain? Basically, they will, they will get to it probably a week later, still no show. A week later, still no show. KATC investigates looked into the complaint. Officials at the Lafayette Parish Fire Department confirmed that they have been asked to look into the conditions at the apartment complex in the past. Records show that in 2017, Hembola Manor LLC and its parent company was sued after a ceiling towel fell on a tenant injuring them. The lawsuit alleged that Hembola failed to keep the premises free of hazardous conditions. It was settled out of court. Hello, this is KTC. He tried to speak with management on the property. No one was there to open the door. Shouldn't the property owners be held accountable? Should be. It should be. That's a question that, we, that we're asking. Elro Broussard, Lafayette City Council representative for District 1, says residents should not have to live in those conditions. He's hosting a public meeting to address the concerns, but for residents, they say something must be done now. They need to just redo it all over again, move it all out, and just redo it all over again. Now, residents in this community are invited to a public meeting this Thursday at the MLK Recreation Center. You can scan the QR code right on your screen to get the full details on our website at KATC.com. Bruce Art says it's not just Hembola Manor Apartments. He says there are several others that need to be addressed. He said it also points to a bigger housing issue for lower income families in Lafayette Parish. I'm Edgy St. your North Lafayette Parish reporter for KATC TV3.